Hi, welcome. Simon here and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll be walking you through step by step on how to upgrade your NVMe M2 solid state drive. Here I'm holding the 2 terabyte and I'll be upgrading into my Lenovo um, Slim 7. So let me show you the model here. If you turn it around, take a look at the bottom part of your laptop. It says Lenovo Slim 7 Carbon 13 IAP7. That is the model of my laptop. I'll be upgrading the uh, NVMe M2 SSD drive. All right, the first thing I like to use would be my T5 screwdriver. This is the T5 Torque 5. I'll be removing the screws here. The screws are not the same, so the one on the top is a lot longer and the one at the bottom is shorter. There are three screws on the top and three screws at the bottom. If you're not sure where to buy the tools or the NVMe solid state drive, please go ahead and check the link down description below. I will direct you to the right website, for example, like Amazon or eBay, where you can find the replacement parts or, and the tools for this repair. The next step, I'll be using a metal prying tool. I just want to stick in between that little gap for the back cover plastic here. So I'm just sticking in between, give it a little bit crack, meaning that the clipper is separating the computer as I'm going along the back cover, you can hear that little crackle, crackling noise, which is normal. All right, once you have that back cover removed, let's put it on the side. Here you can see your full laptop, what is happening. Obviously this is the battery, the CPU fan, the RAM, and your hard drive. So here I like to change out the NVMe drive. So I'll be using a Phillips screwdriver. This is the very tiny screwdriver, which is the 1.5 millimeter. Tiny little screw, unscrew, and lift it up slightly and slide it away from your body. So the thing is to slide in to install, to remove is to slide out. Here is my replacement NVMe and what happened is that I just wanted to uh, give you a heads up. If you are buying a brand new NVMe that has not been cloned or installed Windows, your hard drive is not going to work because all your information are still in here. You follow me so far? So before I replace the drive, I actually make a clone of it. So what I did was, assuming that the original drive is still here, I put my new drive in this USB adapter. This is the NVMe M2 USB adapter. So I have my two terabyte drive in inside. This is not the right, right one, I'm just explaining it to you. So um, I was doing the clone, meaning I plug it into my laptop, I clone it over from the original towards to the NVMe drive, my new drive. Once I have cloned it, that's when I insert into the new computer, I mean into the computer. Okay, so for those of you um, who does not want to clone and you want to do a fresh install, yes, you can do that. So assuming that you install the new drive, right, the next step is to go ahead and get yourself a Windows 10 or Windows 11. Um, you can get it from Amazon or eBay. Get yourself the USB installer and fresh install your Windows in the new drive. You can do that as well. All right, so I hope this, this video is helpful. If you have any question, comment below. Um, I do read your comments and please smash the like button for me. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Until next time, bye now.